If you jump out of your hiding place and surprise me, you win. But if I sneak up and surprise you, I win. That's why it's called Hide and Surprise! Okay, I'll hide first. Ready or not, here I come to surprise you. Surprise! Yay, yay, yay! Surprise! I win! Okay, it's your turn to hide. Oh, I'm going to hide, all right. Somewhere Percy will never find me. Surprise! Ah! Ah! Sorry, but it's hide and surprise, remember? I love this game. <laughs> Percy will never find me in here. <laughs> surprise! Ah! <laughs> He'll never find me here. Surprise! <laughs> Diesel's undercover. Surprise! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> oh, <laughs> the perfect hiding place. Surprise! <laughs> He's not gonna surprise me this time. I'm gonna surprise him. Ha ha ha! Nailed it! Surprise! Ah! Diesel? That was great! Surprise! <laughs> hey guys, is the telescope here yet? Not yet! Bullstrode should be here any. <gasps> Thomas, what happened? What do you mean? Ah! Thomas, I told you not to cut through Crumble Canyon. So that's what you said. I knew it was something like that. You look terrible. Like, really terrible. Huh? Pfft, I just got a little dinged up. No biggie. Thomas, what on earth? You have to get to Tidmouth right now. Right now? But I want to see the new telescope. You know, but you have to get repainted immediately. You don't want to rust, do you? Rust? I'm so glad you came to see me. You've got a bad case of the scrapes. Oh, can't believe I'm gonna miss Cranky unloading the new telescope. Scratches and dings do turn to rust if you don't fix them, Thomas. And you don't want rust, Thomas. Rust is the worst. I hear it's super itchy and scratchy and really uncomfortable. Oh, it is. You should be fine, Thomas. See, got you all fixed up with a fresh new coat of paint. Good as new. Great. Thanks, Sandy. I feel the need to lead with speed. You okay? That's a lot of hay. It's no joke. My coupler broke. The cows need this hay. Well, it's on my way. I'll take it. You gotta watch your stack out on the track. Remember, it's tall. To tell the truth, one little goof, and the whole thing's gonna fall. Got it. I'm gonna lay on the speed. There's cows to feed. Uh-oh. Thanks 
for bailing me out on my unstacked route. But I'm back on track. I've learned to keep an eye on my stack. Friends come from anywhere, and anyone can be a partner on the rails with me. Your best friend isn't there to have your back. Just let a new friend in and give it a spin to help you get back on track. Good friends come from anywhere and anyone can be a partner on the rails with me. Just let a new friend in and give it a spin. Just let a new friend in and give it a spin. Just let a new friend in and give it a spin. themselves to McCall's farm. Let's go! Uh-oh. Wait! What is it? I can't steam, and I lost my peep because I'm out of water. I'm a diesel, so I don't need water. Catch me if you can. <sighs> That's it. I have the hick ups. Hey, Thomas, is there like a really big chicken around here? No, it's me. I took on water too fast, and I think I got the hiccups. So bad, I can't do the delivery. Oh, I hear steam blasts help, like this. <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> that might have worked. <laughs> the cows have hiccups. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> A good surprise always cures the hiccups. It worked. It's a good thing we diesels never get hiccups. <coughs> I guess we do get hiccups. <coughs> oh. Chugga, chugga, snooze, snooze. Little train so sweet. Chugga, chugga, snooze, snooze. Rest your wheels and go to sleep. Chugga, chugga, snooze, snooze. Slow your pistons, no more steam. Shut your eyes, time to dream. When you
chugga chugga snooze snooze when a sleeping train goes night Chugga chugga snooze snooze, it's such a lovely sight. Chugga chugga snooze snooze, when a sleeping train goes night night. Dum 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 dum, dum 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 dum. I thought that one plus zero added up to zero fun. Turns out the no fun number isn't always the number one. On my own, on my own. As long as I can pretend I'll never be alone. On my own. You can sail across the seven seas, rule a kingdom from a throne. Take a trip on a rocket ship, past the moon to the unknown. On my own. On my own. I thought that one plus zero added up to zero fun. Turns out the no fun number isn't always the number one. On my own. On my own. As long as I can pretend I'll never be alone. On my own. You can sail across the seven seas, rule a kingdom from a throne, take a trip on a rocket ship, pass the moon to the unknown, on my own, on my own, as long as I can pretend I'll never be alone, on my own, on my own, all on my own. I'm gonna chug, I'm gonna chew, I've got a delivery to do. Up hills, down hills, around each bend, taking this cargo to the end. I'm gonna chug, I'm gonna chew, there's got to be a way for me to get in front of you. I'm gonna jug, I'm gonna chew, I'm almost up to you. Up hills, down hills, around each bend, taking this cargo to the end. I'm gonna jug. There's got to be a way for me to get in front of you. I'm gonna chug, I'm gonna chew, I'm gonna catch up to you. I'm gonna chug, I'm gonna chew, I've got a promise coming through. We're gonna chug, we're gonna chew, we're gonna help push you. No one on the rails today but me. 
just the way I like it. Mama. <laughs> Mama. Huh? Mama. I'm not your mama. You want something with feathers who says caca and... Mama. No. Mama. No. Mama. No. Mama. You don't give up, do you? What's your name, little guy? Mama. Okay. I'll call you Wilson. Hello, Wilson. I'm Diesel. Now we're buddies. Next stop, Random Dogs to find your... Mama. Not your mama. More like a big brother. Mama! Wilson, you have to be more careful. Mama. <laughs> no, more like a super strong uncle. Don't worry, Wilson. We'll find your mama here. Mama. Hey, Diesel. Looks like you picked up a passenger. <laughs> trying to find his mama. Mama! Well, I'm glad he's found his mama. They grow up so quickly. It's hard to see them leave the nest. <clears throat> you did a good thing. Helped him find his mama. Yeah, I guess so. Huh. Better go pick up my delivery. <gasps> mama! Now she shouldn't be down here. She should be up at the duck pond. Okay, ducky. I'll take you home. A mama's work is never done. <laughs> yeah, you're a cutie. <gasps> wow, I made a new sound. <gasps> I love it. Hey, sheep, listen. <gasps> huh, they're jumpy today. <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. Hi, Nia. Don't scare the butterflies, please. Oh, wow. Hey, have you heard my new sound? <gasps> uh, wow. That was pretty loud. But cool. But loud. Oh, no. It was too loud, wasn't it? Well, too loud for the butterflies. I'm going to find a place where it's okay to be loud. Good luck! Oh. <laughs> Here's a good spot. <gasps> Gordon, wait till you hear my new sound. Ania, what's wrong? Sorry I woke you up. I have a great new sound, but it's too loud to play anywhere. Well, sometimes it's fun to be loud. <laughs> you need to find a place where being loud won't make others cranky. Cranky? Great idea, Gordon. Oh, what are you doing here, Nia? This. <gasps> wow, nice loud sound. I like it. <laughs> nice one, Bullstrode. to the bridge like you did to the tunnel? Electric idea! Let's find out! I can plug in and power the bridge. No power, no problem. Let's roll! Uh, Kana? 
something wrong? <sighs> the bridge is down. But now, so is my battery. I'm out of power. It's okay. Go on to Vickers Town. I'll be fine. Grab on, Kana. Everything's connected, right? Now you're connected to me, and I'm going to Vickers Town. Way to go, Purse. On the left is the Vickers Town Lighthouse. It's dark right now, but when it's lit up, it's... <gasps> Spectacular! Incredible! Just beautiful. Thank you. We definitely got our scenic route, as promised, Thomas. Well, the electricity's all connected, but so are we. We all did it together. Yep! <sighs> I'm sure this tour will be the highlight of their visit. Oh, oh, Annie, I made a pun. Oh, you did. Good one, Clary. Hi there. I'm all charged up and ready to go. Come on. Why don't we all connect for the ride home? Hook me in. I'll lead the way. Electric! <laughs> if I was a super train, I'd always do good deeds. Here to there and everywhere. Thanks to my super speed! Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were super trained, you'd do a lot of good. But anyone can be a hero right in their neighborhood. I'd be so strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers. I'd always do good deeds, here to there and everywhere, thanks to my super speed! Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were super train, you'd do a lot of good, but anyone can be a hero. I'd be so strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers are great, it's true. But nothing's more super than just being you. If I was a super train, the world would cheer my name. But even if you lost your powers, I'd like you just the same. Thanks for the help loading, Carly. No problem, Cranky. Loading Volstrode is fun. Watch this, Sandy. Ugh. Nice lift, Carly. Maybe one day you'll be as strong as Cranky. As strong as me? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, yeah? Well, how about this? That's a pretty big load, Carly. That was pretty big, Cranky. Can you top it? Of course I can. Look at this. <laughs> Whoa, take it easy now. Wow, how are you going to beat that one, Carly? Hmm, that's nothing. How about this? <laughs> Excuse me, what's happening? I'm... <laughs> how about this? Oh, yeah? Hmm. Hey, Carly, do this one next. Whoa! Get me down from here. I'll get you, Sandy. I am not happy about this. Oh no, Bullstrode! Oh, sorry, pal. Whoa! Was that really necessary? No, it was not. But it was amazing. Ah, enough playing around. Let's work together. It doesn't have to be a contest. <laughs> Oh, no. Now 
what have we done? I got this. Oops. That's not right. Well, I guess our lifting contest was a tie. Away? Come on, knights! Let's catch that dragon! Huzzah! Hmm? Huh? Must be my incredibly vivid imagination again. Oh, of course, it's just a dragon! A dragon? Run away! Ah! <laughs> I got you, James. We're here to rescue you from the dragon float. Save yourselves and... What? Dragon captured! We're playing dragon. And it got away from us. I see. Well, perhaps this time, one of you can be the dragon, and I'll be the handsome and almost unbearably charming knight. I'll be the dragon this time. Dragon? There's a dragon? Run away! Run away! Roar! Come, Knight Kana. Let's save the kingdom from the beast! Lead the way! Lead the way! What's at the end of the rainbow? What do you think we'll find? Nobody knows what a rainbow holds. But I have a few things in mind. Hey! What's at the end of the rainbow? It's gonna be a great surprise. Hey! What's at the end of the rainbow span? Look! It's some old rail ties? Doesn't seem right. Hey! Over there! We'll find a rainbow's end if it's treasure or it's not. We're so close now and we're gonna give it all we've got. Aw, oh, Bolt. What's at the end of the rainbow? What do you think we'll find? Nobody knows what a rainbow holds. But I have a few things in mind. Hey! I hope what we find is a golden headlight. I hope it's new wheels so shiny and so bright. What's at the end of the rainbow? Aww! What's at the end of the rainbow? Hey! It's gonna be a great surprise. What's at the end of the rainbow span? You won't believe your eyes. Hey! It's just a head now. We can't always see the end of the rainbow. Whatever will there be? Taking letters and packages down the rail. My favorite thing is to deliver the mail. <laughs> hey, first, you're looking excited today. Just one delivery left. It's a super special party balloon for Sir Topham Hat. Look! Oh no! It's getting away! I have to get that back! Come on! Back up! Back up, back up, back up! Go, go, go! I have to get that back! <gasps> there it is! <gasps> I got it! I don't got it. Hey! Come back here! We have to get it back, or Sir Topham Hat's party will be ruined. Follow that seagull! Well, hello there. Excuse me, Cranky. Will you lift me up to those gulls? 
I suppose so. Percy, you're scared of heights. What are you doing? I have to deliver all the mail. That means getting my... <laughs> balloon! <laughs> Okay, let's deliver this balloon. Come on, Locomigo. I got you. Sir Top Hat, your special party balloon. Oh, yes. Perfect. Thank you. I'll add it to the others. The others? They're lovely. Oh, oh dear. Boys, would you mind? Follow that, Sir Top Hat. Oh, my. Don't worry, Sir Top Hat. We'll get you back to the party. We're just gonna have to put our heads together and think of something new. Between you and me, we'll find a plan B or C or D. Between me and you, we'll get this delivery through. I've got an idea. Sugar and flour will be our base stacked up right. Make a pretty sweet brace, keeping eggs, milk, and butter in the right place. Sodor Skipper. A Sodor Skipper? I thought we were looking for butterflies. We are. A Sodor Skipper is a really big purple butterfly. Purple? Like me? Electric! Hmm. Not here. <gasps> Over there! It's amazing! <laughs> <laughs> wow. They get scared easily. Maybe they're just not ready for someone as fast as you. Good point. I won't go fast. <gasps> That one over there is purple! It is a Sodor Skipper! Well, it was. Maybe she heard you coming? <laughs> I might have been too loud. Okay, so we need to be slow and quiet. <gasps> Look over there! Where? Slowly, slowly, getting closer, closer. <gasps> so beautiful. <gasps> so perfectly purple. Look out! I guess no matter how slow or how quiet we are, we're always going to scare away the Sodor Skippers. But it sure was fun looking. There's one on your head. head. The electric. This rocks. Harold to Thomas and Percy. Howdy, fellas. Over. Harold! Harold the helicopter? Wow. It's so cool to see you. <laughs> Roger that. Right back at you. Over. First mate Percy, we're coming to a fork in the, uh, the ocean. Let's go left, toward the cows. I think he really wants you to look at them cows. <laughs> uh-huh, yes. Thomas and I are delivering a submarine. The left fork. We're going 
toward the cows! <laughs> they are nice cows. Well, I gotta deliver at the docks. Over and out. Bye, Harold. See you soon. Ah, uh, he can't hear me over his rotors. <laughs> Are you okay, first? Sorry, Captain. Couldn't hear you over Harold's rotors. Yeah, I couldn't hear you either. His rotors are loud. Harold is amazing, though. Absolutely. But you need a way to communicate so we'll understand each other if it gets loud again. Even if it's loud, our whistles are louder. How's this? One peep will mean yes, and two will mean no. Great. And one long peep or toot for faster, and two for slower. Right, got it. And four quick blasts if you want to go super fast, and a blast and a half if you want to go like a little bit faster, and also three quick peeps if you want to stop. And then, stop. If then, you want to get then. That's a lot to remember. So you good? Well, great. Let's get back on track. Um. First mate, Percy, let's go fast through that tunnel. One long peep. <gasps> okay, that was one long peep. That means go faster. <laughs> he understood me. Okay, let's do this. <gasps> the bridge is up. We need to stop. That's three peeps. <laughs> Huh? What did 12 peeps mean? Oh no, maybe Percy can't hear me on the other side of the mountain. I gotta try something else. Oh. Huh? Oh, fun! Tom sent up a stop signal. A stop signal? Stop! <laughs> Phew. Dum de dee dee dum, another quiet day on the river of Thomas. So, so quiet. Hey! Sorry, switching right. But this isn't my shortcut. No, but uh, you'll see. This way is much better. But it will take us twice as long. No! Cole's farm is way out of our way. I gotta get back across Crovins Creek and into the forest. Hmm. Oh, uh, Gordon, I heard you delivered all the cement for the ferry terminal at Norrenby by yourself. That can't be true, can it? It can, and it is. <clears throat> it was no small job, let me tell you. All the cement had to be delivered in one night, and no other engines were available. Well, everyone said it couldn't be done, but I said it's blocked. This is definitely the way and to go. To well, by that time, I had delivered only half the cement. It was almost morning. Time was running out, so I dug in and... What? Why are we in the forest? These bricks have to be delivered as soon as possible. Well, we'll get to Normby much faster this way. We're not going to get there at all this way. We have to go the other way. I insist. Switching right. Hey! Whoa. Oh, my brakes! And, uh, uh, Thomas, uh, wait! See? We're crossing Quick Draw Bridge. Uh, yes, but we're crossing it in the wrong direction. And look, there's the big windmill. This is definitely the way to go. Uh, no. You're thinking of the other windmill. Back into the forest is the way to go. What are you doing? I'm taking us the new way. But this is not the right way. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Go left! No, go right! Huh? Thomas? What are you doing over there? Whoa! Uh-oh. Oh, Thomas, I, I might need some assistance here. I'm coming, Gordon! Hold on! Whoa! Whoa! The stop 
wandering off like that? I'm doing my best, Gordon! And we're back on track! Uh-oh. Everything okay, Tom? Yo! The tracks are closed! Stop! Phew! That was close! Today, I'm gonna go further than I've ever gone. To the lighthouse! The lighthouse? Oh, that's too far when the wind is this strong. You'll never make it on your own. <laughs> what? I like the wind! I can get there and back all by myself! No, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! This wind is so strong and gusty! I can't steer! Whoa! Maybe Cranky was right! Huh? Hey, Skiff. Mind if I come along? Thanks for the wind block, Bullstrode! But I really wanted to sail to the lighthouse all by myself. You're still the one sailing. We're just cruising along next to each other. Hey, good point. Lighthouse. Here I come. Whoa, is that Skip? Hey, Skip. I've never seen you this far from the docks before. That's because it's a new record. Great job. Hi, Volstrode. Hi, Thomas. See you later, Skiff. Be careful getting home. Don't worry. After getting here, getting home is going to be a breeze. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, now. Slow down. I told you it was too windy to make it all the way to the lighthouse. But he did make it there, all by himself. Well, uh, good job then, I, I guess. Uh, how'd you do it? Well, I had a little help from Bullstrode blocking the wind for me. Aw, I only helped a little bit. Turns out going alone is a lot more fun when you take somebody with you. <laughs> My ad spy. Oh? Well... Let me guess, another tree? Or is it rails? We've been on this route a kajillion times. There's nothing new for your eyes to spy. It was a tree. Well, my eyes spy something blue. Is it me? <laughs> no, they have a beautiful smell. So, not me. Uh, he's always right. There's nothing to see here except for tracks and trees. Yes, there is. It's those blue flowers right beside the tracks. Oh. I never noticed those. Mia! How do you even see this stuff? Well, we don't have those flowers where I grew up in Kenya. When I saw them, I thought they were so beautiful. And they only grow in Sodor. Okay, but really, what's a secret? <laughs> Everywhere I go, I ask myself, what's awesome about this place? Hmm, let me try. My eyes spy. <gasps> those hanging vines! Those flowers are pretty awesome. And, oh, my eye spy, that shadow you're making, Mia. It looks just like a dinosaur. <laughs> awesome. Roar! Ooh, ooh, let me try. I spy this gravel. Oh, that's so amazing. And that rusty old switch is so beautiful. It's true. I never noticed that rusty switch before. Now you're getting it. There's so much to see if you just take a moment to look around. I know. I've been in the dark woods so many times, but everywhere I look, I see new things. It's blowing my mind. <laughs> Let's catch up to Nia. Uh, guys, you'd better slow down. Slow down? Whoa! my bumpers that was close. Whoa! Oh no! The orange tree! We can't show up to the plaza without those amazing orange trees. But I'm sure we can think of something else to bring. Mia's right. There must be something else we can do. No, nothing will be as awesome as those orange trees. 
Except, maybe those orange flowers in that bush I never noticed before. <gasps> we can use flowers from Sodor for the plaza. Oh, yeah. We passed lots of plants that would be perfect. Great idea. It's a long way to Harwick. Oh, I don't want to do this. We've got something else. Thomas, I think my axle is cracked. A cracked axle is terrible. Yeah, except the axles are fine. <laughs> well, my boiler is leaking. Boxcars don't have boilers. True, but my underpins are overpinned. That's not a thing. No more delays. Let's go. Aw, a bolt. Uh, Thomas, your coupler is loose. No, you've been checked and rechecked. But it's for real this time. Oh, no. Whoa. Oh, I blame myself. I blame you, too. You guys were pretending again that my coupler was broken. Your coupler broke? Oh, that's bad. But we'll fix it. Now you, I believe, Sandy. I told you not to pretend you were broken. Well, you pretended your wheel was broken first. Well, you pretended you had a leaky boiler. Mux cars don't have boilers. Next time, let's just go. Well, this is a fine how do you do. Hi, Gordon. Everything okay? No. Thomas and I are delivering ties to the bottom of the mine, but my headlight just burned out. I can't join him without it. Oh, well, I can help you. Stick close to me. I'll light the way. Thank you, Nia, but do be careful. This mine can be a dangerous place. <gasps> Watch out, Nia! A runaway car! Um, Gordon, that's your car. In my car? Oh, yeah, we have to catch it. Go oh, over this way. Here. Ah, there it is. Whoa. Oh, we're getting close. Come on. Oh. oh, I forgot how beautiful the Crystal Cavern is. It's incredible. Oops. Ooh. Yeah, this mine is quite spooky enough without that, Nia. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sorry. This is just a little setback. I think your car ended up over here. Oh. What was that? One of the crystals. It lit up. Whoa. <gasps> Come on. The crystal cavern is going to help us find your car and get out. 
Pam ba. Ding ding dong ding. <laughs> Whoa. We found my car. Yes. Um, what are you doing? <laughs> Dancing. Look. <gasps> Let me try. I think we just might dance our way to a delivery. Oh, yeah. I thought being number one was done so easily. Just gotta be strong when the load is heavy, revved up and at the ready. Faster than any other train, shiny with the glossy coat of paint. Taking the lead in a big delivery. This is all. Gotta be willing to offer your help, put others before yourself. Know when you should apologize, be honest, loving, and kind. Now I can see a brighter side of me. A true friend to all is how a number one engine should be. I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me. I don't need to feel afraid, won't bend or break or fall, because 
Cause I've got a special bell that takes care of it all. I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me. Caves, monsters, or broken track, I think I'll be okay. This lucky bell sure has a knack for saving every day. I sure am feeling lucky, cause I've got this bell with me. Hold on, Thomas. He should be here any minute. Huh? Oh, right! Young Bao's coming today. He's coming for the fireworks show tonight. I can't wait to see him. And that cool tiger painted on his side. And hear his whistle that sounds like a tiger. Just like that. That must be him. Avast, landlubbers. There's a passenger on board who seems to be eager to see ya. Electric Yay! made it! Roar! Hey, everyone! I'm so happy to be back with you all in Sodor. And I brought a surprise for the fireworks show tonight. All the way from China. Cool! That's awesome! Can you tell us again how you earned your totally cool and sort of scary tiger decal? Please! Oh, tell us! <laughs> oh, it wasn't such a big deal. I was just trying to help out. Can we oh, please with axle yeah. grease on top? Okay, okay. It was for the time I rescued... <gasps> Annie and Clarabelle? Annie and Clarabelle? I thought you rescued an engine from an ice cliff with a snowplow. No! James is pulling Annie and Clarabelle this way. But the crossing arm is stuck, and they don't see Gordon coming. We have to stop them. Oh, yeah. Guys, I was trying to say before... Gordon! Gordon! Huh? Great gear! <laughs> Oh, thank you, 
Young Bao. Nicely done. Whew. Thank you, Young Bao. So electric. Oh, you weren't even brave. scared. What's wrong, Thomas? Well, I should have been the one to have saved the day. I saw the crossing arm was stuck, and I was going to tell someone, but... Young Bao is our hero. Did you see that? Oh, yes. So you had a chance to be brave and missed it? Yeah. I wish I could have shown Young Bao how brave I really am. Well... You may not be the bravest engine on Sodor, but you did get to see Young Bao bravely leap to the rescue. Well, I would have too. You really are the bravest engine. Well, we'd better get to our delivery so we don't miss the fireworks tonight. Bye, Young Bao. Bye. Bye.